Hello, hello everyone. Hope you're having a great day. Hey, hey, hey. Hi from Dion Irwin here. Dion Irwin Real Estate Team, Raybacks House of Real Estate. Coming to you live from Airdrie, Alberta. I'm gonna show you this gorgeous new listing we have. It's just, well, it's coming soon. It's not listed yet. We just staged it and we're gonna put it on the market soon. Hey, hey Debbie, <laughs> it says you wanna join me on the video. Do you wanna join me on the video? Hey Tyler, Debbie, Caitlin, hey girl, how are you? I was texting you earlier, I miss you a lot. My heart is hurting. I haven't seen you for so long, Caitlin. Please, please let me see you. I need to give you a hug. I miss you a lot. I hope you're having fun visiting your family. I know you're done. Oh, I'm going to show you the staging. Yes, we're doing so much staging lately, Caitlin. And this one is, I just saw it for the first time. My staging crew is so great. They've been doing the greatest job. Those two guys are absolutely amazing. They lift all the furniture and they also do all the beautiful design, decorating everything. Like, oh, I don't know what to say about those guys. So I'm gonna show you this house. 118 Canals Circle. Is it circle or close? It's 118 Canals Circle, I think. Anyway, Caitlin, I know Caitlin has, has had a very busy summer. She's taken care of clients and um, also been on the wagon, the chuck wagon circuit with her family. So it's been really fun to watch um, Caitlin and all the things they've done. They've done, had a great season. So congratulations, Caitlin. We're excited for things to start rolling in the real estate, really digging in. And uh, thanks for taking care of clients while you've been away as well. So thank you for joining everybody. It's Dion Irwin here, if, if you don't know. Hello, Anne, how are you? Caitlin, Tyler, Debbie, Debbie doesn't want to, she said, she, there was a little notification saying Debbie wanted to join my video, but then it disappeared. Debbie's like, nope, didn't actually want to join in the video. So Debbie, is an awesome friend and she is a realtor on our team debbie sheen this is the listing she's in charge of we met these people a while ago and they had listed it uh, they just decided to go with another team or realtor and they didn't stage it and anyway we took it over didn't sell that time we took it over we staged it we're just going to list it now so Hopefully uh, it goes very well for them. It's been going great so far. We try to have great communication, keep in touch with our clients. So Debbie, thank you for doing that for these people, for showing them the way. We have a special way we do things and we like to do it the same way and give people the great service, make, show them how to do it, take their hand, lead the way, because that's why they want us to be their realtor, right? So anyway, Debbie's doing an awesome job with our clients. So thank you, Debbie. Uh, oh, Megan, yay, hello, hello, hello. It looks so great, I can't wait to show it to you guys. So it's a, it's a home with a fully finished basement. It's got a, a main floor den with office flex room. And it's got a bonus room upstairs. It's got a attached garage. It's on a really great street. It's got some mature trees, nice landscaping, a nice big deck in the back. So I can't wait to show it to you guys. Oh, Debbie, I'm sure they're the nicest people. And how could you? How could somebody not be nice to you? I think we, we give, we get what we give. So good job, Debbie, and to my whole team for giving and just being awesome people. It's not an act. You guys just are awesome. So thank you so much. I really, really appreciate it. Um, it's great to see Tyler and Debbie today at our Realtor Open House. Caitlin, next time, hopefully we see you there. And thanks to everybody, all my team, for watching. So I'm going to stop talking so much. I know I like to talk a little bit about my team. I get a little bit excited about these people, all right? So happy afternoon. Did I say good morning? I hope not. I might have. It's afternoon already. 
Okay, I'm going to flip this around. We're, we're in Airdrie and in the canals, 118 canals circle. And I'll show you guys the front. It's an attached, it's a duplex. So um, it's a great, great property, really affordable, really clean, super nice. Okay, let's flip this little guy around. Uh, let's see, how do we do that? Oh, here, they switched some place. They switched where it is. Okay, so it's a really great street. It's in the, it's in the middle of Airdrie. Um, so I parked my car on the driveway. You can't really see the front, but it's got this nice big tree. So it keeps things private. And you know what? I'm going to get the sheet out here of my car because it says the square footage on there. Tried to be organized. This is a close up of the tree, okay? It's a fantastic tree, everyone. This house is 1545 square feet. It's got a nice little landscaping here, nice stone. You could put a small table and chairs here, or maybe just one comfy chair if you want to read a book or something there. Okay, so here we go. They've got new flooring here. Beautiful new flooring. Check out this floor, you guys. It's beautiful, all right? It's a very cozy feeling when you walk in. So we have got a nice closet. The garage is right here. I haven't looked in here yet, so let's see. Oh, it's actually a really nice size. Where's the light? I don't know where the light is. It's a really nice size. It's a single garage. It looks... They've got some shelves in there already built in for storage. Some hooks. It's a really nice, it's decent sized single garage, okay? Fit your car in there easily. Okay, closet, and then we have laundry right here on the main, which is nice. A lot of these units have them in the basement, so this one is on the main floor. Okay. Plush home staging did such a great job. So here we've got a flex room. I've seen people use this like a toy room or, but a lot of people use it for their office. I mean, you could put a piano in here, anything like that. It's a really cool space on your main floor. Powder room right here. And then we've got a great living room space. Look at how cozy and inviting this is. Lots of windows. Good sized kitchen, lots of cabinet space. We've got um, a good amount of counter space, pantry area right there. Got the raised bar for more seating. My kids would be eating breakfast there. They love their um, island bar area. Okay, can everybody hear me okay? Is everything good? What do you think? Hi, Bo. How you doing, girl? It's a quiet street. Oh, Tyler liked the close-up of the tree. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, ladies. I really wanted to get, uh, you know, everybody, the tree lovers. Pamela, thank you for watching. Debbie says it has good storage. There's a lot of storage in that garage, yes. Okay. The railings. I love when my agents watch because they help to point things out. That's an upgraded railing there. Okay, let's go check out the upstairs of this beautiful home. See, so 1545 square feet. Oh, oh, I think I turned the fireplace on by accident. Check out this bonus room, you guys. We've got a huge section all up here. Let's turn the fireplace off. Okay, look at the sectional. We've room for a sectional and a chair. Side tables, lamps, coffee table. It's a lot of room and room for your TV as well if you want TV up here. Windows, there's blinds on the windows. The staging is so great. It's so nice. These units that have the bonus rooms up here, they're hard to find. Okay, here's the first bedroom. We've got a single bed. You could easily fit a double in both of these rooms. Blinds everywhere. Plus, Nice sized closets, okay. The paint is nice and fresh. 
It's in really good shape. We've got tile floors, which is really nice. So there's your main bath. There's a linen closet. Here's your next bedroom. Cute, the cutest thing. It's about the same size as the other one. You can fit a double. It's perfect fit. It perfectly fits a single, but a double could go with a side table as well. And then here is your primary suite. Look at this. So you could have a king in this one for sure. Could surely have a king. There's a lot of room over here. Look at that. Lots of space. Got the little bench here under the window. And it's got a private ensuite. Check that out, everybody. Private ensuite tub shower combo. There you go. Nice and clean, ready to move in. So it's vacant. Possession could be quick, which is a really nice thing. And also, check this out. It's got a walk-in closet, you guys. Oh my goodness. What do you think about that? Okay. <clears throat> now I said the basement was developed. Is it? <coughs> Excuse me, my mouth is dry. My throat's dry. Okay. I haven't, oops. Hello. I haven't looked in the basement yet. What is the deal with this thing? Okay, so what do you guys think? What's your favorite room so far? I think I am in love with this bonus room right here. That's my favorite room, I think. Debbie, yes, basement's developed. Oh my goodness. Okay, Debbie, hopefully you can stay on here because I need you to confirm the price. I know you were confirming it. So maybe when I'm done, you can type it in, but not yet. Okay, we're gonna type it in. Actually, I'll show you guys the view here of uh, the room when you come down the stairs. Okay, so there's the whole overview. Nice open concept, but also it has that beautiful flex space right here. Would you check it out? So if you wanna see this, it's really easy to get into because it's vacant as well, okay? Okay, so I haven't seen the basement. I did not turn the lights on. And my gimbal keeps going weird. It keeps turning. Okay, so here we go. We got a railing and everything. It's done to code. A lot of basements I find don't have railings. Anyway, this one's got a nice railing. Ooh, there's a fireplace down here. This is so nice. It's got a fireplace. I don't know if this TV's staying, but I would probably, I wouldn't think so. Anyway, there's a nice, nice room for all your sound equipment here. This is a great space down here. So it's just a nice open space. I've seen a lot of these that are not finished very well. And they're kind of done, but this one's really nicely done. They've got like a little theater area, kind of like a little theater down here with the lights, the sconces and everything. And oh my goodness, also another bathroom with a jetted tub. This is amazing. You could put a Murphy bed down here or something if you wanted to have guests stay down here. So that would be great. Okay. And look at all the storage. So these ones, I mean, a lot of people don't put bedrooms in here, but I mean, you could totally make this easily into a bedroom. It would be very huge, but you could make this space right here. It's got a nice big window. You could make this into a bedroom. Um, it would just be probably a spare room or whatever. Makeup area. Oh yes, Debbie, thank you. New hot water tank. It's a nice hot water tank, you guys. Okay. The furnace is high efficiency. Is it not a new furnace? It looks, well, high efficiency in 2008 or whatever. So this was definitely an upgraded furnace when it was built. It would work for a bedroom, right, Caitlin? You could totally make this a fourth bedroom. Okay, the furnace has been serviced. It's got a new blower. They've taken good care of it. We got central vac as well. What else can I tell you? I think that is a great property, okay? So I'm going to let you know. Um, Debbie likes the bonus room. Is that your favorite? 
what my favorite well the whole thing is great but i think my favorite room that they staged is the bonus room it's a, like a beautiful surprise you go up there and it's like whoa there's a whole giant sectional couch up here so it's a lot of room okay so this home oh man i need a drink of water <clears throat> This is 118 Canal Circle Southwest Airdrie, Alberta. And I'm going to say thank you all for watching. I'm not leaving yet. But, so three bedrooms, bonus room, living room, um, main floor, flex room, office, den, playroom, whatever. Finished basement that looks like it's set up really nicely for a theater room down there. I will be watching movies down there for sure. Okay, who wants to know the price? Who would like to know the price of this house? Oh, Debbie told us it's 454.9 for this home. So 1550 square feet plus the basement is, so it's like 16, 1700 square feet of fully finished space with an attached garage and a fenced backyard with a lovely, it's a large deck. Let me, I should probably show you guys that. Let's flip it around. See, there's the deck. It's like a two level deck. Also has a little bit of grass over there if you got a doggy. Nice white railing, so it's really nicely done. So anyway, photos we're getting back tonight, I think. So if you wanna see this home, you gotta, message us tell your realtor to message us and we'll get you into this home okay so i hope you all have a great thursday I, I call it friday eve so have a great friday eve everyone and if i don't see you again i hope you have a great weekend if you have any questions about real estate or whatever anything like that about my team or real estate or staging you can always message this page here the the team page so thank you for watching um, I will see you soon. Take care, everyone. Bye.